Hey guys, I heart movies here and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 9. Let's get let's get out of the ice cavern finally and go outside and have some fresh air at last. Yeah, I wanted to meet you guys at this cave here to avoid any random battles on the way up here. And I matched a few more abilities along the way. Um Garnet Master Kira and Panacea from the rod, um Steiner Master Antibody from the bronze gloves, I believe. And um I think it's the non master flea deal also if I haven't already. So that's pretty much all we need to do there, so. Yeah, so my setup's still the same as the last episode. All, all my equipment's still the same as well. So, hey, hey, hey we found a nice village. So let's do uh, not not visit. Um, well, I, I, yeah, I guess you have a point. I mean, can we disguise her, or we can give her a new identity? I, well, whoa, okay, don't push him off the frickin' cliff, Steiner. Just chill. Um, no, we're not doing. No, no, we're not going through the parts again. I'm sorry. And yeah, we're trying to, like, she wanted to be out of the castle. Don't bring her back. And you're stubborn as a mule. And yeah, she does need a new name. I mean, we're going to uh, places she's never been to before. People know that she's a princess, so we need to, just, we need to cover up that fat. And here's a little weapons lesson. Weapons lesson. Um, yeah, we know that. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, blah. No shit, Steiner, it's a weapon. She knows that. Your new name is Dagger. That will work. Yeah, if you want to rename her something else, by all means do so. I'm just gonna leave it as Dagger as it is, so. Hey, hey, it works for me. Yeah, if it works for you, it works for me. What are your speech? Okay, I guess that's a good idea. Yeah, we wanted to blend in with all the other townsfolk, so <laughs> Alrighty! Thumbs up! Have a nice big grin on your face as well, just because you have to. There we go. So, are we moving? Yeah, let's go ahead and not get moving. Yeah, and see where we ended up here. We're above the mist right now, finally, so we can breathe some fresh air. So, back to the world map we go. To some more lovely, peaceful world map music. If the game will ever load. There it is. Okay, so let's let's check where we are. First things first, we were on the, Nor the Norwich Heights. So, do we go anywhere else around here? Um, let me see here. Um, I think there's a gate around here, if I'm not mistaken. Um, let's go ahead and open up the map real quick. And take a look, quick look around. Oh, here we go, right over this way. Yeah, there's new enemies around here as well. I'll be showing up on the way to um, the village, so I'll be doing that momentarily. And random battle already! This happened before with the other gates. I was right there and um, didn't, have, didn't have a chance to press X, and we're fighting a random battle. New enemies! Oh, not new enemies. New enemies. A giant mutant spider. This is not pause. This is a carved spider. Um, nothing too hard. You didn't. I think you didn't use slow on you or something. It's um, nothing really to worry about there. Your python, same as always. Physical attacks on him will be just fine. You see how massively powerful. Ugh, burp, excuse me. You see how powerful Zidane is now with the mythical dagger. He's well. He's far and away the our strongest character right now. So he'll be in the front row for a little while just because he's so uber powerful. So there we go. Also, it does more levels on the way, also. So it's mentioned. Wanted to mention that real quick. All right, let's, let's go ahead and check out this gate up here. Will this be South Gate, perhaps? Well, we found the North one earlier, but we're not sure which one this is. So what can we do over here? Well, nothing. It looks, it looks like. All right, can we pass through? Oh, gate pass. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll we'll come back later then. Okay. Anything else we can do? Take a break. Oh, okay. Uh, well, let's, let's go ahead and wait for it. Let's see what uh, we can buy from her. And uh, yeah, let's talk. Um, South is border between Alexandria and Lindblom. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I would hope so. I'm gonna do border patrol and all that. Been on an airship. Um, yeah, I have been actually. We were just on on one at the start of the game. So, uh huh. Um, okay. Yeah, need a day pass. Blah 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 blah. There she is. Hi, Mary. Nice to meet you. Let's go buy stuff from you. Can I talk to you? Let's go ahead and shop first. What do you have to sell? Um, usual stuff here, actually. Although, I do want to sell some stuff. Actually, do I? No, actually, no. I don't recommend doing that. Because um, we can use these things to make stuff later on. We'll leave it at that. So, okay. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and rest while we're here. You know, 100 bucks. Not, not too bad. Plus, I needed a refresher after the uh, boss battle anyway. So. Anyway, okay, that's all we can do here for right now. So just a nice little side detail area, just to learn a little more about the area around here with the Alexandria Lindblom border and all that. So that's nice. That's a nice touch. I approve. Depending on the world map, I think there's one more enemy around here I haven't shown off yet. Um, actually, in the forest, I know this one for sure. Let's go ahead and make our way over here. 
I still have the other force over here. It's closer to the village. So let's let's go. Kind of like a turtle's force, actually. How it, like, it's kind of small and risen up in the middle. Yeah, well, I was waiting for a different battle music there. If you hear, if you hear like, a really light-hearted, like, blat, like la di da sort of tune like that, you'll know you're fighting the, the new enemy around here. But yeah, these guys, we just fought them, so they're easy. Yeah, I think they might be vulnerable to some elements. I'm really not sure. It doesn't really matter. And Lodge would say Blizzard because they're using fire. So, um, I'm just doing them and try Blizzard. I haven't shown that off yet. Alright, here's our attack web. Yeah, that can slow you if it hits. Um, it actually just might hit at this point. Um, yeah. Mm, excuse me. Yeah, nothing really to worry about there. Yeah, slow just means your ATB bar just moves up slow like it always does in most Final Fantasy games. Oh, I should, I should be stealing from these guys too. I totally forgot about that. Well, this guy will. If this guy is still alive from Zidane's turn, I'll go ahead and, um, steal. So, there you go. And an antenna. That would probably hurt. I mean, their antenna's as tall as we are, for God's sake. And there you go. I mean, wouldn't that suck to see a spider that big in real life? Like, I would just shit myself. I would just hate that so much. It's one thing I do hate. I really do hate spiders. I mean, I just hate seeing them. Uh, I've never been bitten by one or anything, obviously, because I would, like, that would just plain suck. Yeah, I have yet to be bitten by a spider ever, and I hope that never happens, because, that, again, that would suck. Well, so here's the village right over here. So let's, do, let's hop over this way first thing, to a spiral-looking thing. Kind of looks like the uh, spiral tower from Wild Arms too, but it's definitely not it. And what do we have over here? Oh, nice little peaceful cottage over here. With a high potion. Nice. Yeah, I know someone lives here. We're just gonna run around and steal your crap. Hope you don't mind. Okay, there's one more thing back over here on the ground here. Some money. Nice. Yeah, that covers the uh, cost at the end over there also. So, hey, it works for itself. And who lives here? Oh, hi there. Oh, wait, um, didn't catch that. I'll, I'll look over there in a second. Oh, coffee. Can we have some? Well, actually, uh, Zidane's probably a little too young to have it. He's only 16. Uh, what's this over here? Instructions. Streaming is to occur once every two days. Ha, ha, ha. Case of emergency. Change the flight on the observatory to yellow. Oh, interesting. So I just use ship coffee? That seems kind of weird to ship coffee around, but... Oh, whoa. Oh, how would you know that, Zidane? Well, how'd you have the money to, for all that? Oh, doesn't really matter then. Oh, that's right, yeah, the whole airship crashing thing. Oh, we can get that. Ooh. I like that. It looks really, really nice. That'd be awesome. Do you want to try Berman, Kerman, and Motor Coffee? Okay, well, we'll find those for you. At least I hope to, anyway. There's only, yeah, only three of them. Yeah, we'll find those later on in the game, so don't worry about those for right now. Let's just going to go up here first. A very, very long spiral staircase to lead to up here. Yeah, there's a flight he's talking about over here. And let's see, what's this over here? What is that? It looks like a weather vane to me. Um, yeah, the wind's blowing. Um, I'm not sure which stretch of this would be. It's pointing to the right, so it might be east, but I have no idea which way we're facing right now, so. Oh, there you go. Yeah, I love the music here as well, by the way. It just really just sets the mood somewhere that's a nice, peaceful area. No stress. It's a you know, stress-free area, so I really do like that. Just makes you feel relaxed, you know? Okay, now let's go ahead and make our way over to the village to our immediate... Uh, well, Zidane's right. Our... the screens... I don't know. Okay, oh, what the... crops? Crop circle? That looks kind of freaky. There's an eye, like, right there. That's weird-looking. So let's just go ahead and go over here to our nice little village here. That's apparently only two houses. Although it's, it's not that small. Yeah, it's bigger in person. Hey, a windmill! Hey, yeah, we already really, got it really in first. V Vivi, it's a windmill. It's not that exciting, but I guess he's never been here before, nor has anyone else for that matter, so... Yeah, this is a good idea, so um, let's go in and regroup first and try to figure out what the hell to do next. Yeah, we can hold up here in the town for a little while. I mean, no one really knows that we're here. Or really knows of us for that matter, so... Oh, hi! Okay, oh, that was a little weird. And this is the village of Dolly. Yay! Not Dolly Lama, of course, just Dolly. You yeah, just a nice little peaceful village on the top of the mountains. And you're sleeping on the job. That's just great. Hello! Wake up, damn you! And yeah, can we, um, you know, sleep here and stuff? We need to talk about stuff. Oh, okay. Oh, no charge? Hey, hey, awesome. Oh, oh yeah, about that. Um, <laughs> awkward. 
And yeah, sorry, but um, no private rooms here, yeah. Yeah, she's noticing that it's a little different than the castle, as, to, as she's already noticed, and will continue to notice. And of course, still shaking his fist at everything that Dawn says and does. Nice comfy room here as well, and there's treasure chests in there, we'll be nabbing those as, as soon as we can. Oh, what's one thing? Oh yeah, that seems kind of weird that you would want to leave, but like, why? Kind of crash. Uh, oh, wait. Oh. But why Lindblom? Oh, yeah, I didn't think of that. Well, we still need a gate pass to do that, so we can't really do anything about that for right now. I thought, oh. Oh, uh, okay, well, yeah. Okay, we can do that. Um, uh, well, hey, um, she's already been through enough danger as is, but she doesn't want to return to the castle, so we're here to protect her. Why does one person have to protect Garnett? I mean, why can't mul multiple multiple people protect her? I don't see any, any problem with that. Why are you little? Aw, oh, Vivi's sleeping. Aw, oh, how cute. Yeah, I would imagine he was. I mean, we just had a crazy adventure through the ice cavern, so I would imagine he'd be exhausted. There you go. Stretch! The next day... Oh. Who's singing? That sounded great, but who was it? Stretch. And yep, it may have been her. Oh, okay. Well, we're the last one up, but as we sleep in quite a bit. Yeah, okay. Oh, ATEs. Let's go ahead and watch um Dagger Tries first. As so we can see what our other party members are up to right now. Causing mischief and mania and uh, stuff and I don't know. And yeah, that she did a little overboard there. Uh, for only launching a freaking bomb at us to kill us, essentially. Um, I would have assumed some people actually did. I mean, the airship did crash right into people as we were leaving, so... Oh, yeah. Yeah, she's still learning the uh, ways of the uh, normal folk around here and all that. But yeah, throughout the course of the game, we actually did, yeah, we have a nice chance to see Dider grow as a, as, as a person. I mean, for one thing... From learning how to be like a normal person and having uh, being out of her sheltered life in the castle, actually explaining the world for what it is. Yeah, I mean, why are you? Yeah, she has no idea why she's killing the buds or anything. I and mean, she just has no idea like, how things normally work out here in, in villages like this. I mean, again, she's been living a sheltered life for 16 years now, so she has no idea how things work around here. Oh, hey, Nodloff. Yeah, she's not a. Oh, yeah, I would say so. I mean, it's a, a, a small, annoying, bouncy bug. And it probably would be a good idea just to try to blend in. Ah! Well, here's a nice try. I mean, she's learning, so of course it won't happen automatically. Let's, let's go ahead and nab some more treasure around here. Yeah, just that definitely blends in. You can, can't even see that thing there, actually. Let's go over here and nab this for an antidote. Nice. Anything else around here? Not that I know of, actually. Um, anything top right corner? Oh, there is something over here. For your reading pleasure, how to save one million gil. Earn money the easy way. Oh, that would be awesome. <laughs> These books suck. <laughs> well, that could actually, you know, be useful. You know, saving money is usually a good thing. Oh, more ATEs. Let's go ahead and watch VV Confused. Oh, hi. Um, VV, are you going to talk to them or anything? They're kids just like you. Hey, you're... You're... You're what? Are they going to tell us? They seem to be afraid of Vivi, but why? I mean, he's just a kid just like them. I mean, they've never seen him before, but there's no reason to be afraid of him. Huh. Well, that's just kind of weird and almost sad in a way, actually. I mean, Vivi's never seen kids his own age before, besides Puck. So he doesn't really know how to react to them or anything. So, oh well. And I think for right now, this is a good place to stop. I'll, I'll watch the ATE for next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. This has been Iron Movies on Enough, guys. Have a nice day, and thanks for watching.